Alexander Ryback Alexander Ryback Russian Alexander Igorovich Ryback or Aleksandr Igorovich Ryback Belarusian Aleksandr Igorovich Ryback born 13 May 1986 is a Belarusian Norwegian singer composer violinist pianist and actor though based in Oslo Ryback extensively worked on television programs and on tours in Russia Belarus Ukraine and Sweden throughout the early 2010s. Singing in mainly English and Russian, Ryback, in his early 20s, held on to a teen idol status in Scandinavia, Eastern Europe, and, to a certain extent, in Western Asia. His debut album, Fairy Tales, charted in the top 20 in nine European countries, including a top position in Norway and Russia. After two pop albums in 2009 and 2010, Ryback desired to be more of a family-orientated artist, focusing on children's and classical music alongside and frequently performed with youth orchestras throughout the world. Ryback is known for his extensive involvement in the Eurovision Song Contest. Representing Norway in the 2009 contest in Moscow, Russia, he won the competition with 387 points the highest tally any country has achieved in the history of Eurovision under the then voting system with Fairy Tale, a song he wrote and composed. Winning at the age of 23, Ryback remains the youngest solo male winner of the contest and the only Belarusian-born winner. His win was celebrated all across Europe for crushing stereotypes about the contest, such as needing an over-the-top performance or the negative influence of neighbor voting. Since then, Ryback has been involved several times in the contest. He represented Norway again in the Eurovision Song Contest 2018 in Lisbon, Portugal, with the song That's How You Write a Song, winning the second semi-final and finishing in 15th place in the grand final. He provided as an opening act to the grand final in 2010 and as an interval act in 2012 and 2016. Ryback has frequently provided commentary on the contest, working as a journalist in 2011, as once-off judge on the Belgian preselection in 2016, and as commentator on his personal social media. Early Life Ryback was born in Minsk, Belarus, which at that time was the Belarusian SSR in the Soviet Union. His parents and most of his other family hail from the town Vipsk in northern Belarus. His father, Igor Ryback, a well-known classical violinist, who performed alongside Pinches Zuckerman, defected to Norway in 1991 after a concert tour of a Belarusian chamber orchestra of which he was part of. Ryback's father lived with a musical family who gave him shelter and food in exchange for violin lessons for their son. Alexander Ryback and his mother Natalia Ryback Nigirina, who worked as a music journalist and a piano teacher, arrived in Norway on a tourist visa and were initially refused a residence permit. Eventually, the Ryback family settled in Nesodden in the early 1990s. Ryback and his family received Norwegian citizenship after seven years of residing in Norway. At the age of five, Ryback began to play piano and later violin, but eventually picked up violin as his main instrument. He stated, I always liked to entertain, and somehow that is my vocation. He became a student at the Barrett Du Institute of Music in Oslo at the age of 10. As a result of his success in the 2009 Eurovision Song Contest, he took a break from his bachelor's degree studies at the Institute, but in 2011 he returned to his studies and in June 2012 he graduated from the Institute with a Bachelor of Music in Violin Performance. Career Rur. In 2004, Ryback was awarded the Anders Jar Culture Prize presented to him by Victoria Ryback at the annual Culture Festival in Madrid, Spain. In 2005, he entered the Norwegian version of Idol, Idol, Jacked in Pa and Superstern, reaching the semifinal. In 2006, Ryback won Campus Jansen the Great Opportunity, a talent competition hosted by the Norwegian Broadcasting Corporation NRK with his own song, Fulin. Ryback has collaborated with artists such as Ahaz lead singer Morten Harkett and Arv Telefsen. In 2007, 
Ryback played the fiddle in Oslo Nighteater's production of Fiddler on the Roof and won the Hedda Award for this role. Eurovision 2009 Ryback won the 54th Eurovision Song Contest in Moscow, Russia, with a record 387 points, singing Fairy Tale, a song inspired by Norwegian folk music. The song was composed and written by Ryback and was performed with the modern folk dance company Frikar. The song received good reviews with a score of 6 out of 6 in the Norwegian newspaper Dagbladet, and, in an ESC Today poll, he scored 71.3%, making him the favorite to get into the final. In the 2009 Norwegian national heats, Ryback achieved a clean sweep, gaining the top score from all nine voting districts and ending with a combined televote and jury score of 747,000. 888, while the runner-up, Tone Damley Auberge, received a combined score of only 121,000. Ryback later won the Eurovision final with a landslide victory, receiving votes from all the other participating countries. Ryback finished with a total of 387 points, breaking the previous record of 292 points scored by Lordi in 2006 and scoring 169 points more than the runner-up, Iceland. After Eurovision, film and the first album. Ryback's first album, Fairy Tales, was released after his Eurovision win. Ryback also co-stars as Levy in the film Johan, directed by Gret Salomonsen, which was released in March 2010. Ryback also went on a tour in Norway with former Norwegian Eurovision winner Elizabeth Andreasen, something that had been decided before his Eurovision win and participation. He and Frikar also toured Norway and Europe in 2009. In a December 2009 performance of his hit Fairy Tale at the Nobel Peace Prize concert, held at the Oslo Spectrum, Ryback shared the stage with nine other acts. EMI Norway has just released a film entitled Fairy Tale, the movie, directed by acclaimed Norwegian director Rune Langlo, documenting the journey of Alexander Ryback since claiming the top prize for Norway in Moscow. In 2009, he recorded the theme song called I Don't Believe in Miracles slash Superhero for the Russian action movie Black Lightning produced by Timur Bekmambetov. 2010-2011 on 30 January 2010, Ryback performed one of his new singles, Europe's Skies, in national final, Eurovisa 2010, to select the 2010 Finnish entry at the Eurovision Song Contest 2010. On 12 March 2010, Alexander Ryback performed his Eurovision 2009 winning song, Fairy Tale, on UK TV show Eurovision, Your Country Needs You. In April 2010, Ryback released a new song, featuring Opture, called Fella Ijin. On 8 June 2010, Ryback released the first single from his second album, O. Oh. A music video was made for the single. It was directed by Lars Christian Fleming, produced by Eirik Heldel and shot by Martin J. Edelstein. It is filmed in a university or college. He also recorded and released a Russian version of this song called Strela, a mirror Russian, Strela Amira, Cupid's Arrow. Alexander released his second album on 14 June 2010, called No Boundaries. It was not as successful as his first album, so far it has peaked at number 7 in Norway, number 8 in Sweden, and 32 in Finland. On 7 January 2011, Ryback was one of 12 contestants on the next Swedish season of the dancing show Let's Dance Swedish version of television franchise Strictly Come Dancing. In the show, Ryback danced to win the competition against other Swedish celebrities. Ryback made it to the top four before being voted off on 11 March, having received the lowest scores from both juries and the voting public. In 2011, he released the album Visa Vid Vinden's Anger, a collaboration with Mats Paulsen, whom he describes as a legend and a great friend. On 11 December 2011, he appeared as musical guest on X Factor Romania. 2012-2013 2014-2015 Ryback performed a song for the 2014 How to Train Your Dragon 2 soundtrack, 
entitled Into a Fantasy. Into a Fantasy was added as a European and Slavic bonus track to the album, and was played during the closing credits in the European and Russian releases of the film. Ryback had sent in the track unsolicited to film company DreamWorks, which was charmed by the song and decided to include it in the soundtrack for the closing credits. On 4 May 2014, he released a song alongside another Eurovision winner, Marija Serafovic, titled Gorko A. Trabrost, meaning Bitter Bravery. Ryback took part in the hit, a live TV show on Norwegian broadcaster Enarkeum, on 10 October 2014. Ryback performed What I Long For, a song written by Illa Sabat M. Janger. Despite it being the most played track ahead of the results show, it lost out to try and reign with the story of love, which went on to eventually win the whole show. Ryback wrote two entries for national selections for Eurovision in 2015. Ryback wrote a song for Maltese singer Franklin Kalaja titled Still Here. The song was received well and finished fourth in Malta Eurovision Song Contest 2015. In autumn 2014, Ryback traveled to Belarus to form a girl band to represent Belarus at Eurovision 2015, after having thought about the idea for over a year. Auditions were held in five different cities across the country. In early November, Ryback revealed his girl band Milky, and shortly after that premiered their track Absent. The song quickly became the favorite to represent Belarus at Eurovision 2015 among fans and receiving positive feedback from former Eurovision participants Marija Serafovic and Philip Kirkorov. On 26 December, Milky finished fourth in the Belarusian national final, receiving the second highest tally of votes from the public. The result led to great controversy, and Ryback critiqued the jury for putting the entry fifth. In early 2015, Ryback took part in the Russian television show Odin v. Odin, in which the participants impersonated legendary artists. The premiere episode was broadcast on 8 February, in which he impersonated Elvis Presley. Despite initially refusing to portray female artists, Ryback impersonated Gloria Gaynor, Conchita Wurst and Russian folk singer Lyudmila Yumina, for which he received top marks from the jury. After the 14th show, Ryback was placed sixth and therefore was not among the five who automatically went to the final. However, the judges said that he deserved a place in the final and made an exception. In the final results, he was the runner-up. With the televoting results, he took a clear second place with 32.1% of the votes, behind Rusland Aylno. Ryback released a new Russian single entitled Kotik slash Kotik. The music video of this song, which was filmed in Moscow, Russia, and it was released on 3 June 2015. Kotik quickly reached positive acclaim, and its music video attracted a lot of views. It topped Belarusian Belma's TV charts. Kotik became one of the most watched Russian language music videos in 2015. Despite it being a hit online, Kotik did not manage to crack the Russian radio charts. Ryback later declared that radio DJ refused to play the song as they felt it was a childish song, and some DJ were asking Ryback for financial compensation for playing it. While announcing his desire to stay a children's musical in 2013, Ryback could not find the funds and support for this project. Instead, he decided to create a children's book with a CD with songs and an audiobook attached to it. Ryback initially struggled to find a publisher for this, as most publishers were only interested in the physical book. Eventually, Ryback released Troll, Ogden Magisk Fella through Kaplan Dam. Quickly after that, the Danish rights were secured, and the book was also complemented by Edward van de Vendel, who proof translated the book's first chapters into Dutch. On 12 June, a new Norwegian song, Blant Efjel, Among Mountains, was released. 2016-2017 In early 2016, Ryback was a one-off jury member in Eurosong, Belgium's selection for Eurovision 2016. Ryback also performed as a part of the interval act for the Eurovision Song Contest 2016 in a musical number satirizing Eurovision songs. Shortly after that, he released his lead single, I Came to Love You, 
which music video was shot in Greece. In 2016, Ryback marked his 10 years anniversary as an artist with re-releasing former singles, such as his debut single Foolin, and five to seven years. Next to that, he held several concert shows under the title Entertainer. Ryback sang Fairy Tale during the final of You Decide, the preselection of the United Kingdom in the Eurovision Song Contest 2017. That same year, Ryback teamed up with German singer and violinist Francis Weiss and had a duet with her on his singles Fairy Tale and Kodak, while also performing the former at the annual Schlagerboom Festival. During the Eurovision 2017, Ryback publicly supported Portuguese singer Salvador Sobral to win the contest. Sobral eventually won Eurovision with Amor Pilo's Doys, breaking Ryback's 2009 record. Ryback released his own version of the song, including self-written English lyrics. This version was later covered by others including Eurovision 2018 contestants Senek and Ari Alassan. Although Ryback previously disliked the idea of returning to Eurovision, he revealed in late 2017 that he was thinking of returning to Melody Grand Prix. Eurovision 2018 In January 2018, it was revealed that Ryback would be taking part in the Norwegian national selection, Melody Grand Prix 2018. The song initially received very mixed reviews. Ryback stated that he wanted to take part mostly for pleasure, rather than wanting to win the competition, stating that Norwegian singer John Tajan, who participated 14 times in the Norwegian selection and won three times, was his inspiration. Ryback was not the bookmakers and experts favorite to win the selection, but topped several public polls ahead of the competition. To his own surprise, and to the surprise of both of the presenters, Ryback won the selection. During the show, Ryback topped four international juries Russia, Estonia, North Macedonia, and Czechia more than any other contestant. Ryback proceeded to the last four, where he first beat Alexander Wallman in a duel and then proceeded to the final duel with singer Rebecca, which he also won. After the show, several news outlets claimed that Norwegian broadcaster Enarke had favorized Ryback, putting him last in the running order. Enarke denied this, pointing to the voting statistics that showed that Ryback had won with a large margin. He won his first duel with 94.3% of the votes, and his final duel by 71% of the votes, receiving a total of 306,393 votes, the third highest number of votes an entry ever reached in Melody Grand Prix history. Ryback was drawn to perform first in second semi-final on 10 May and finished first overall, becoming the first ever Eurovision performer to win two semi-finals after he also won the second semi-final in 2009. In the final on 12 May 2018, Ryback performed 7th in the running order and finished in 15th place, receiving a top jury score from Italy. 2019 Present In 2019, Ryback's children's musical troll on Den Magisk fellow premiered in Christian Sand and received wide critical acclaim by reviewers. The show sold over 10,000 tickets and had to schedule extra performances, to curb the demand. In 2020, Ryback co-wrote an entry for Melody Grand Pre-2020 together with Joust for singer Magnus Bakken called Over the Sea. The song won the fourth semi-final of the selection show and proceeded to the final, where it eventually lost out to Ulrich Brandstorp's attention. Ryback was set to appear as part of an interval act at Eurovision 2020, which was later canceled due to the COVID-19 pandemic. As a result of the contest cancellation, several countries organized a produced show or held a vote to determine their country's favorite Eurovision song of all times. Ryback's fairy tale finished third in Wallonia's Vater Top 20, 17th in the Netherlands's in Pio Radio 2 Song Festival Top 50 list, and 6th in the United Kingdom's special Eurovision Come Together show. Fairytale therefore re-entered the UK sales chart at hash 65 in late May 2020. A year prior, the Norwegians had voted Fairytale as their all-time favorite Eurovision song. Artistry, musical style and genres.
about his own musical style, Ryback has said, Generally, I do everything from writing folklore, children's music, dream works songs to arranging for symphony orchestra, and making cover versions of Eurovision songs. I do not make more albums. I like to publish one and a song on YouTube. It can be a classic piece, a pop voice. Ryback is often classified as having a tenor de grazia voice. Ryback has also been noted multiple times for having a strong natural vibrato in his voice. His voice has been appreciated for creating whole and clear sounds. Personal Life Ryback was raised in the Orthodox religion. In family circles and in his childhood, he used to be referred to as Sasha, the Russian diminutive for his first name. Ryback did not visit his country of birth for 17 years between his emigration to Norway and his first performance in Belarus in the summer of 2009. Though he grew up as a child alone, Ryback revealed he had a sister, whom he was estranged from, from an earlier marriage of his father. In 2012, Ryback met his half-sister for the first time in many years. Ryback bought a new apartment and lives now at Akerbrig Oslo, Norway. Ryback speaks Norwegian, Russian, and English fluently, and has performed songs in all three languages. Ryback has also performed in Belarusian and with Elizabeth Andreasen in Swedish. In 2010, Ryback was featured in the media negatively after a few incidents of uncontrolled anger. Both times, Ryback had a heated discussion with a sound technician. It resulted in Ryback breaking his fingers in May 2010, and during a later instance, also breaking his violin on stage. Ryback then said, I never raised my voice before, and that's why I did what I did. I'm just a human being and perhaps not the glossy image many believe, so it was good to get out frustrations so I could go on. It's only me that goes beyond the same. Ryback later blamed the behavior on his hectic touring schedule, which led to him being overworked, also opening up about battling with the depression due to his touring schedule, calling early 2011 the toughest moment of his life. He later stated he had to learn to say no. In 2018 and 2019, Ryback struggled a lot with an unidentified illness, which led him to cancel several performances. To Ukrainian newspaper KP, Ryback said he was initially diagnosed with fatigue-related problems after his second Eurovision participation. In October 2019, Ryback declared he was hypochondriac, stating all people above 20 have their own battle with something. Ryback stated working in a group for his children's musical Troll on Den Magiskin Fella has helped him. For this production, he temporarily moved to coastal city Christian Sand. In May 2020, Ryback revealed that he had been addicted to sleep medications and antidepressants for 11 years and has begun to recover after entering rehab in January. Discography Fairytale 2009 No Boundaries 2010 Visa Vid Vindens Anger 2011 Christmas Tales 2012 2012 Filmography Awards Winner of Spar Olsen Competition for Young Classical Musicians in 2000 and 2001. Winner of Anders Jars Culture Award 2004. Winner of TV Talent Competition Campus Janssen 2006. Winner of the Hedda Award to the Newcomer of the Year in Norwegian Theatre 2007 for the title role in Fiddler on the Roof at Oslo Night Theatre. Winner of Norwegian Melody Grand Prix 2009, with the highest score of all times. Winner of Eurovision Song Contest 2009, with the highest score of all times. Winner of Australian Radio Listeners Award for European Musicians. Winner of the Marcel Bezenken Press Award at Eurovision 2009. Nomination Emma Gala Best Foreign Artist 2009. Winner of Russian Grammy for Newcomer of the Year 2010. Winner of Norwegian Grammy Awards, Spellman of the Year 2010. Winner of International Russian Name Award in Moscow, 2011. Winner of Countryman of the Year, Belarus 2013. Winner of Melody Grand Prix 2018.